I've heard so many different numbers regarding risk of kidney issues per X years on lithium. What numbers do you quote patients? Yeah, the numbers I quote is one to 5% at 20 years. So to drill down on that a little bit, it's 1% at 20 years. Um, based, this is based on large Scandinavian databases where they have the entire country literature, um, medical records. So they can say everybody who got lithium in Norway, Sweden, Scandinavia, everybody's medical records who develop kidney impairment for their entire life. So if you take a look at all the people that got lithium, 1% of them at 20 years had chronic renal insufficiency. If you look at people who took lithium for 20 years, it was 5%. So the range is one to 5%. I mean, you're prescribing lithium now, you don't know if the patient's gonna be on it 20 years from now, so you can say their risk is 1%. But you could say if they stay on it for 20 years, they might have a 5% risk. But again, full doses, multiple daily dosing. There are other studies, again, from mostly from uh, Scandinavia, looking at people who had lithium kidney impairment. They've done renal biopsies on them. They've looked at their histories. And these studies find that a major predictor of long-term kidney impairment is multiple daily dosing. So giving it once a day reduces the risk a good deal. Another point to make is that there are other studies that looked at kidney biopsies long-term and lithium treatment. And in those in one of the classic studies, 60% of the patients had no kidney effects at all, 60%, six zero, with long-term kidney uh, lithium treatment. The other 40% had some kidney effects, some most commonly 30% uh, or so had renal tubular effects that led to decreased concentration capacity. That's what leads to people urinating more frequently. That's not harmful. It's not going to kill them. It's just and inconvenience that they urinate more frequently. It's only 5% or less that will actually have um, degeneration of the nephrons. So the point is, you know, the 5% or less is what we care about. There's gonna be maybe a third that will have some other kidney effects that are reversible and not harmful. The other point is that 60%, the majority have zero effects in their kidney. Kidney is actually fine, despite long-term treatment with lithium. So that's some of the detail on it. 